guys, uh, got a quick word that I really feel God has just really been moving on me about today. And I uh, wanted to share that with you guys. Um, you know, a lot of the times I realize that we go through problems day in and day out. And life's not easy. And um, some days we feel like we're on the mountaintops. Then there's other days that we're just so depressed, you know, that there's all this burden that's on us. I mean, it could be a care of whether you're gonna pay bills tomorrow, how you're gonna pay bills, or uh, what's tomorrow hold, what's tomorrow look like. It could be any reason, any care that you have. But as I began to pray, I realized, you know, there's certain scriptures that I feel that really, that I wanted to share, and, and that God has kind of laid upon me this subject to kind of talk about that's very important. So here goes. First scripture that comes to mind is, you know, a lot of the problems that we have and a lot of the cares that just kind of weigh us down. You know, today's world, we call it stress and worries, right? But they're burdens. And um, God just said, I just, scriptures like Matthew 11, 28 through 30, Jesus says, come to me all who labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me for I am gentle and lowly in heart, and you will find rest for your souls. For my yoke is easy and my burden is light. First um, Peter 5, 6 through 7. And guys, these scriptures speak for, him, for themselves, so I don't know who needs to hear this, but I really do feel someone needs to hear this. Um, Therefore, humble yourselves under the mighty hand of God, that he may exalt you in due time, casting all your care upon him, for he cares for you. So, you know, have you ever gone through times in your life where you just feel like, God, I have all this stress and all this worry. I don't even know how to pray about it. I don't even know the words to say. It's just this jumbled ball of emotions that I need to get off my chest and that I'm worried about, I'm stressed about. And sometimes it's not even a lack of trusting him or anything like that. It's just worries. They get us all, you know, whether it's bills, whether it's career decisions, whether it's, you know, finding a significant other or need to be loved or what's what's tomorrow hold, the status quo, whatever it may be. Um, the Bible says, humble yourselves that he may exalt you in due time. And then the fact that our Savior cares about us. Y you shouldn't be dealing with these things by yourself. Get on your knees. He says, cast your cares upon me. Uh, my yoke is light. In other words, he, he'll take this burden off of you. There's a reason why the Lord prayed, give me this day my daily bread. And it's, it's, it's just amazing to know that God cares about us on a personal level that he's like, listen, you don't have to go through this by yourself. Whatever you're dealing with, whatever rejection, whatever depression you're dealing with, give it to me. If it's day by day, and even if you don't know what to say, you have the spirit which, which um, intercedes for you on your behalf. God, you get to a point in your prayer. Have y'all ever got to this point in your prayer? And I know it's not just me where God, you just have all these emotions and you don't even know how to pray. What you, you're just so broken, defeated. You get to the point where the Lord just intercedes for you. Literally, by the Spirit, you begin to speak in tongues and the Lord on your behalf begins to lighten your load. And that's the kind of God we serve. He's, he's a personable God. He wants to get intimate with you. He cares about you. He wants to take every burden, every heavy load from your chest, from your life. And he says, you don't have to face it alone. You're not alone. Um, you're very much loved and um, he'll give you rest. He'll make you, he'll give your soul rest. He'll take that burden from your heart and he'll just lighten it. And that's the kind of God we serve, guys. So just a couple of more scriptures. The righteous cry out in Psalms. David says, and the Lord hears and delivers them out of all their troubles. Now, one last scripture that I wanted to share was uh, in Galatians 6, 2, you know, scripture talks about to bear one another's burdens and so fulfill the law of Christ. Guys, if there's anybody you can reach out to, to let them know, hey, listen, if somebody has a burden and you can meet that need or somebody has a need and you can meet it, by all means, meet that need. Um, you know, and just... Let your brothers and sisters know that you're there for them in love, uh, just as Christ is for us. And just get on your knees and just pray. I'm telling you, there's a difference. when, If you're just going through it, I don't know who's out there that's going through it, but if you're going through it, whatever the struggle may be, whatever the problem may be, just, just give it to God and he'll give your soul rest day by day.
just give it to him and he'll give you your daily bread. He'll anoint you. He'll rejuvenate you. He'll make you feel whole again and that you're not going through whatever problems or valleys alone. He's really with you hand in hand. And so I just wanted to encourage you guys and let you know I love you and uh, be encouraged in Jesus' name. Okay, God bless.